You know, they always say, never work with children or animals. Well, I want to add to that list. Never work with directives or actors. How's it going, viewers? Brad Proprietor of Barstool Entertainment doing another GTA 5 video. In this mission, Mr. Richards, we meet Solomon Richards, head of a studio. And basically, this is how Devin Weston has hooked Michael into allowing him to use his crew by giving him the opportunity to basically work on a movie and produce a movie. Now, Mr. Richards is running into some issues, and he wants Michael to help him out. And in this case, Michael taking those flying lessons that Trevor wanted him to take will come in handy. So let's get on with Mr. Richards. Come in, come in. Thanks. You must be Michael. Yeah. You know, I used to have three secretaries. Now I have to make my own coffee and give myself a happy ending. <laughs> See, the ships are coming in. But the walls will hold us. Nelson in Naples. Pluto? I said Mars, you cocksucker. <laughs> Shoulder of Orion. Two. Devin Weston said you were a fan. Huge fan. Tell me, Michael, Devin Weston, did he, does he want you to bump me off? No, not at all. He said you were retiring but might need some help on a movie. Only assholes retire, Michael. Him and my son, they want to put me out to pasture so they can turn this place into condos or a theme park or something. But this place is a dream factory. Well, maybe they have different dreams. Some days, I don't blame them. You know, they always say, never work with children or animals. Well, I want to add to that list. Never work with directors or actors. This picture is going to kill me. All right. So what's it about? It's perfect. Set in Liberty City. Meltdown. <laughs> it's all being shot on green screen right out back there. We take a look at the financial crisis, and then we boil it all down into a really simplistic battle between two yuppies. Lots of training montages. So what's the problem? Milton McElroy. I cast him in the second lead because he's cheap. Zero talent, incidentally. Well, he's got this new agent, Rocco Pelosi. He's been hassling us about renegotiating the deal. So now, He's holding up shooting until he gets paid. That sounds problematic. It would be if the director wanted to shoot. Anton Baudelaire. Ever heard of him? That doesn't surprise me. Now he's having a mental breakdown, pissing all over himself who knows where. <sighs> all right. Looks like you got yourself that new assistant. But no happy endings. <laughs> I love you already. <laughs> Now, Michael has to go and solve the problem, but Mr. Richards was a little light on information. He will call Michael and tell him some other things he needs to know. Unfortunately, background music prevented me from re recording the conversation, in a sense, because I forgot to flip the, the radio off. And that's usually why I flip the radio off is there is some background conversation or stuff that might be interesting, but the music prevents me from putting it in the video due to copyright infringement. Anyway, I'm going to fast forward so that you can get to the main mission. Like this space, it's gonna be an EDM paradise. There's gonna be sparklers, 
fucking models, implants, tramp stamps, all the real shit. That's Pelosi Entertainment. Now give me a minute here, just a minute. Gotta go grab something inside. Johnny, you nearly got the club. We're finally a go. Now you take care of these guys. No cold feet. Okay? Let's go. So Michael has to kind of get to the helipad in a sneaky way. He can't go through the club. So he has to do it on the outside of the building. And this is the route I'm showing you that Michael should take. And you're going to wind up running into some issues. And I'll show you how to deal with those. going crazy. Day trip's over, gentlemen. You're going back to set. Club ain't open, Snowbird. Who's this jackass? Hey, you! Oh, turns out these guys are in love with their contract. They'll be going back to the set with me. Can you believe this fucking clown? No! This guy's all mine! Violence always uh, makes me want to use. Uh, you off this roof. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Sure, man. Sure. All right. Let's get back to the lot. I don't know who you think you are. Now, this is where those flying lessons Michael took um, at the behest of Trevor will come in handy because I'm going to show you how to get these guys to agree to a contract of sorts. You gotta scare them with your flying skills.
I know Solomon is anxious to see you. Look, I'm feeling a little keyed up. How about I call my guy, go on a little jolly, and call Solomon from wherever I wake up in, in a week? How about you see him right now, and we go flying again if you even look like you'll fail a piss test at any point on this shoot? surprise. Anton, my boy, you're an artist, I know that. And this story is the best kind of art, a simplistic, cliche-ridden pile of dross that you will turn into magic. Get a grip, I love ya. So Solomon, Milton here has a little something he wants to say to you. Say it. Ah, uh, I, I just, just want to say that I'm sorry for any misunderstanding, sir, and I I appreciate all the opportunities that, that, that you've given me. Of course, of course. Michael, what can I say? You're a natural. I love you. Well, you're too kind. No, no, I mean it. I don't mean to presume. But would it be okay if I gave you a shout? This shoot seems cursed for some reason or another. I need an associate producer. I'd love that. We'll talk soon. I gotta go. Oh, hell yeah. And there you have it. A relatively fun, easy mission. You get to fly a helicopter. In fact, my advice, go back and take that helicopter and fly it around like I'm having Michael do right now. If you found this video informative, you like it, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon. That is the best way to get more content because I post four videos a week in regards to video game videos as well as shorts and specials and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.